Today's review is the Colonel speaking to you live from the Grange British Imperial YouTube Broadcasting. Now we've got a, an historic record, Odeon 44634, Ave Maria, Eternity, Immortality and the Last Remorse of Love by Byron, recited by Sir Tolmatch St. Clair Baronet. Now he was the earliest born person to make a disc record. He was born in 1825, this was recorded in 1906. Now there's a slight pressing fall to the beginning of this, so I'm going to have to give it some help. Here we go. Ave Maria, for the earth and sea, the heavenly hour of heaven is worth. Ave Maria, blessed be the hour, the time, the prime, the spot, where I so oft have felt that moment in its fullest power. Think for the earth, so beautiful and soft, while swung the deep bell in the distant tower, or the faint dying day him stole the off. And not a breath crept through the rosy air, and yet the forest leaves seem stirred with prayer. Ave Maria, tis the hour of prayer. Ave Maria, tis the hour of love. Ave Maria, may our spirits dare look up to thee and to thy sons above. Ave Maria, oh, that face so fair. Those downcast eyes beneath the almighty dove. What, though tis but a picture in it, right? That painting is no idol, tis too light. Is that high world which lies beyond our own, the rising love in dear? If there the cherished past is gone, the eye the same is set in tears. How welcome those untrodden fears! How sweet this very hour to die, to soar from earth and find all fears lost in thy flight, eternity. Yet, if as holy as men and kings there be, a land of souls beyond that fabled shore, to shame the doctrine of the statute and sophist madly vain of dubious law. How sweet it were in concert to adore with those who made our mortal neighbors night to hear each voice we fear to hear no more. Behold each mighty shade revealed the sight, the Bactrian, Fabian shade, and all who thought the right. But I have lived and have not lived in vain. My mind may lose its force, my blood its fire, and my frame perish, evening conquering pain. But there is that within me which shall tire, torture and time, and breathe when I expire. Something unearthly which they dream not of, like the remembered tone of a mute liar, shall on their softened spirits sink, and move in hearts all rocking now the late remorse of love. Well, there we are, viewers. And thanks very much to the collector who kindly lent me this record, which he bought recently, for us all to enjoy. Thank you, viewers, and goodbye.